Good morning from the Kennedy Farm. Out here walking around where this uh, second orchard of cherry trees is. And uh, got back here in the back. And this is where my son was building his fort. See the trees and rocks laid over. Over there is all the cherry trees that I want to get cleared out. And I'm surrounded by walnut trees, which makes it hard to traverse because you get the black walnuts everywhere. Easy to <laughs> trip over. And here is the pine tree, the back side of his fort that I cut an opening here so he could get in here and be able to climb up in it. I wanted to share. It's a pretty cool pine tree cedar tree whichever evergreen <laughs> but uh yeah you can easily climb these limbs got a nice spot up in here to get in here i got a couple more limbs i want to cut out make it a little easier but yeah it's you can get in here climb in here and have a good view it's on the back side of his fort Just another part of the property that people just don't see. But the whole point of walking back here was to check to see how far back the cherry trees went. If I can keep from falling on these walnuts that are everywhere. But all these through here, not that one, but those up in there are cherry trees. I want to get... Uh, some of this brush cut out from around them and make it to where I can walk completely around it and from the looks of it it looks like they started right there which that stump or root big clump of wood there might have been an old cherry tree trunk from the looks of it that they had bulldozed the ground and everything up right here and stopped and they could have bulldozed a cherry tree and it its roots and limbs under the big pile of rock and dirt that they shoved over here kind of sprouted into a second orchard from the looks of it it's clearly not an intentionally put orchard I mean, you can see the mound here. Get out of the way. Just a mound of rock and dirt. Get these weeds out of here. And these are the cherry trees. So, I mean, there's quite a few in there. I'd have to say at least 20. They're small. Not really developed, so they're still pretty young. So if I can trim it up to where a person can walk up in here. I mean, over there's the root that I was talking about that was on the other side. And that's it's what it seems like. They just bulldoze one up. And its roots just kind of spread everywhere. It kind of popped up in an empty area. Created their own little cherry tree orchard. Which I plan to fully take advantage of. Get these other trees cut out from around it and all these weeds and make a trail around it. Hopefully right down the center of it. Open it up so next year we can walk in there and harvest cherries. But uh, just wanted to share. Have a good day.